Like this is insane. What? What do you do with these? I'm getting really excited about pumpkins. This is hilarious. There's the beautiful thing. So this is the coffee table that I got. Hi, birthday boy. Hello. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. I also feel like I never say this in my vlogs, but if you're new, hi, my name is Carissa, welcome. So I am on my way to go get laser hair removal. I don't remember if this is like my fourth or my fifth treatment at this point. I honestly can't remember. Hang on, I need to switch lanes. I think that it's going well for being four or five treatments in. I'll have to confirm once we get in, but I think, yeah, I still think that I'll need like a few more treatments lots of distractions anyways I do think that I'll probably still need like a few more treatments after that but yeah I'm just getting my underarms and my bikini area done and I just wanted to say hi and start the vlog before I get into the parking garage and it gets to be too dark so hi welcome to a new vlog <laughs> I was trying to avoid talking in a parking garage because I thought it was gonna be too dark but this light is not too bad so where I go for my treatment it's connected to the mall so I think while I'm here I'm also going to stop into a few stores because I mean why not so let's go ahead and get going. I definitely don't want to be late for my appointment. And it's really fast too, which I like. I feel like it only takes like 15, 20 minutes. I think less than that. How's it look? Cool, looks good. I just got to Juan's house and I figured, let me see if I can set you right here. So I picked up one thing from Crate and Barrel, so I figured I would show you it. I didn't pick up anything else and my laser hair removal appointment went really well. I actually recorded some of it so you'll see it. Pretty exciting. Okay. So I got some new coasters. I really like this like slate one. I thought that it looked so good on my new coffee table. So a little bit of a story there. I don't really need a new coffee table, but I kind of been eyeing this one from Restoration Hardware and it's actually like a side table, but because my space is so small i actually had to look at side tables for my coffee tables if that makes sense because the coffee tables were just like massive it's just way too big for me so i'm really excited but when we we as in Juan and i placed that order we actually picked up a couple of things for his place too so we ended up picking up a dining room table and then also a coffee table too Juan, i just got here but he was like measuring out the space for his dining room table it's an 84 inch table it's probably just going to be scooted more this way we still need to get chairs for it and then we ended up getting this rug which i really love i wanted a black rug for in here i have a vision so you'll just have to like wait and see <laughs> a little bit but the coffee table is going to be a 36 inch square so it's going to look really good in the center there and then we still need to get like a little console table for over here because all that will go away that will go away and then i think eventually either we'll get new side tables or those will go away as well and then i've been on the hunt for throw pillows for in here too so we got that that will end up going away too we'll probably 
put like some sort of nice decoration over here there's little Juan working over in the corner. I think after Juan's done working, we are planning to, we'll try to go look for some pumpkins for his front yard, his like porch area. He wants to be a little bit festive. It's his first time like living in a house versus an apartment and there's tons of kids like in his neighborhood. So we're gonna make sure that we're getting like candy and like a bowl and like decorating and stuff for Halloween. It's gonna be so much fun. How's the game, babe? Well, how's the game? Excellent. He's playing a game with his coworkers right now. So far, I'm dead. You're dead. <laughs> when are you gonna be dead? Cause remember the oh, yeah, yeah. Well, the back. place is gonna be closing soon, so we should yeah, probably yeah. go. And it's a gorgeous day outside too. Well, can't really tell right now, but it's sunny. It's really nice. I love my outfit for today. I don't know if you're really gonna be able to see it, but I just have an Aritzia sweatshirt. Lululemon vest. I got my ready to Lulu joggers and then my APL shoes. I love it. <laughs> so funny story. We saw some like felt pumpkins on Etsy and we thought that they would be so cute for some interior decoration. Let's show you the picture of what they look like and then I'll show you what came. It is hilarious. So here's the picture of like the cute little felt pumpkins, right? Super adorable. It's a set of six. So we was like, oh wow, that's super cheap. That's like a good deal. And then Juan called me this morning, like FaceTiming me to show me the pumpkins that came. And these are it. <laughs> it actually took a second for it to even focus. Like these are the smallest, most adorable things in the world. Like for reference, Here's a phone. <laughs> oh my god, what else can I put next to it, babe? Here's my hand. <laughs> I was expecting like apple size. Apple? I was expecting like <laughs> maybe like a couple of inches, but not like that tiny. Like this is insane. <laughs> what? What do you do with these? Babe, they're so much smaller in person. Yeah. They're like the cutest little pumpkins. Oh my god. We had a little bit of a storm a couple of days ago, so Juan's sweeping the driveway and around a little bit, as you would have seen. But these are the pumpkins that we picked up. They're so cute. I'm still like playing around with how to decorate it out here, but I think like this works. I love like this little angle. And then we got tons of like mini pumpkins to go inside too. Okay, I'm still messing with it, but I think that looks a little bit better. But we are gonna cut like the top of the stem off of the white one so that the green one sits a little bit more flat. I love like all like the mixed colored ones, you know, like this one, oh, love this. Love the green one. This one is like my favorite. I love like the little hints of muted orange with the light green. That's super pretty. And I like that this one's more of like a muted orange versus like the bright orange. 
And then this one is one of my favorites too. I love like the long stems. <laughs> I'm getting really excited about pumpkins. This is hilarious. Love these little bad boys. It's a couple of hours later. Juan and I just got dinner. Juan, what did you get again? Tacos al pastor. Did you take a bite yet? Is it good? Yeah, it's really good. And then I just got my usual. I love to get bean burrito. And you guys, like this place has like the best salsa. Wouldn't you agree, Juan? Yeah. And with the chips and then you dip it in like the beans too. Oh, it's so good. So anyways, dinner. And then we're just gonna enjoy some TV. Hey guys, so it's been a couple of days since the last time I picked up the camera and vlogged. So right now I'm putting on some jewelry as you can see and I'm gonna head off to Juan's house. It is his birthday today. Let's see if this even looks good. Um, it's his birthday today so we're gonna go out to dinner and all that sort of stuff but our reservation is i think for like 8 or 8 30 p.m but i'm gonna head over early so that he can open his presents all that good stuff and then there was the furniture delivery for the restoration hardware stuff so i got like a new coffee table and then he got a dining room table as well i don't know if i like jewelry with this mm, i think i'm gonna go without <laughs> So I'm excited to see my new coffee table. Gotta bring it over here, put it in my car and get it over here as well. Hopefully he did a good job inspecting the coffee table too. <laughs> Turn it around here. So this is my outfit for tonight. I couldn't really figure out what I wanted to wear. It's starting to get like pretty cold in Seattle. So I kind of wanted to wear a sweater and be like comfy, you know? So I threw on this Lululemon sweater. I showed it in one of the hauls that I've done. I love this sweater so much. And then I just have some black jeans. These ones are from Aritzia and then some black booties on as well. Don't mind the mess. My apartment is a disaster. <sighs> Slightly overwhelming. And obviously embarrassing but like i got a new litter box for oliver and then over here is like my bag and the present that i'm going to take over to once oh i'm also going to throw on a jacket so let me put that on here we go so this is the jacket that i'm going to wear with this outfit it's a canada goose jacket and then my purse i'm still using the angela roy purse i like this one so much so i'm gonna use that for tonight and let's go ahead and head on over to his house See how the birthday boy is doing. Juan, if you're watching right now, happy birthday, babe. <laughs> Hi, we got to Juan's. Let me walk downstairs. That's where my coffee table is. I figured since I needed to just put it in my car, I was like, there's no reason to take it all the way upstairs, you know? There's the beautiful thing. So this is the coffee table that I got. It's like the cloud module open side table, I think is what it's called. I'm so excited for this beauty. It's gonna be like the perfect fit. Really excited to get this into my house. Babe. Babe. From the top up. <laughs> Hi, birthday boy. Hello. Hello. He just got out of the shower. We won't show him. He doesn't want to be seen. So, you can see behind, the dining room table was delivered too. So we just picked up these chairs from Costco over the weekend. We still have not picked on dining room chairs and we of course needed something. And then of course, like when we start to have people over too, these will be good like extra chairs that we can add on or just for like extra seating or whatever too, which works, but I'm a little tired from walking up those stairs. Oof. So this is the herringbone table for restoration hardware. It's the 84 inch. Yep. And yeah, it's really pretty like weathered gray color. It looks gorgeous. I can't wait to get some like nice upholstered like white chairs maybe in here. What do you think of it? You love it? Aren't you happy that you went with the 84 inch? Yeah. Do you like yours? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't wait to get it in my house. I tried lifting up the table a little bit. It's heavy. I thought that something that I could like, well, you would help me put it in my car, but that's something that I can take upstairs by myself once I get to my house. No. There's no way I can lift that by myself. Is Damn it. Jordan or you can wait until you head over? Yeah. It's gonna have to. 
It's insane. Okay. He's gonna change. And then I like cleaned up his little living room. Did you see that, babe? I cleaned it up. Yeah, so I cleaned up his living room a little bit. We actually got this rug off of Amazon, which I'm pretty impressed by. We have, I think I mentioned at the beginning of this vlog, but we have a new coffee table coming. We saw these pillows actually at Target and I really like them. I got them for my house too. But seeing it here with this couch, I'm kind of torn. I need to like get other pillows and see if the warmth of this can tie into this a little bit more. So we'll see on that. And then I just put this blanket right here, but we also got this blanket from Restoration Hardware too, just like a plush blanket, super soft and nice. So yeah, exciting to see the space start to come along a little bit more. But yeah, it's really, really exciting progress. I'm trying to look for the remote because while he's getting ready and changing, I wanna watch, what's it called? Dream House Makeover on Netflix from like Studio McGee. I think that's what it's called. I've really been liking that. I've been watching a couple episodes of it and I'm obsessed. So I'm gonna see if I can get in, squeeze in a little bit of time watching that before he's ready. And then we're gonna open up his presents and then head out to dinner. Yay! <music> day Juan's birthday was so much fun it was such a surprise that they brought out well we ordered the dessert but they brought it out with a candle and it was just so sweet we loved it so much and we ended up going to it's called the pink door in Seattle it has amazing reviews and it was actually my first time eating there I've been there before for drinks before like nine years ago but this was my first time eating there and it was so delicious. So if you live in the Seattle area, I would highly recommend checking out the Pink Door. Make reservation because it's nearly impossible to get in there if you just like walk in. You know what I mean? It's one of those places that you have to make reservations for. But anyways, it's towards like the end of the day. I'm exhausted. My place is a mess and I've started watching Flipping 101 on HETV a little bit. Um, it's my actually first time watching it and it's pretty good. It's really intriguing, especially the fact that I'm kind of doing and flipping myself so it's just it's kind of interesting but yeah before I end this vlog I got some things in from skims and also from lululemon so I figured I would share with you what those items are duh before I end this vlog off oh you guys like you don't even want to see like this mess behind me I don't even want to show it it's embarrassing we have my old TV I actually tried fixing it and I was successful with fixing the backlighting issue but then in the process we actually kind of broke it a little bit more so that doesn't work but then I have my new TV and that's up and I'm loving it so much I love this little decor piece that we added in oh it's so good you guys. I actually got this bowl from Target. It was only like 20 bucks and then I put like 
some little mini pumpkins in. This one's already turning yellow a little bit. What? This is the mess from Lululemon that I just got in today. And then these cutie little pillows I just got from Target. So I'm really excited for these. I've been wanting to get some like new decor. So we'll see if this works. I think I like the way that this looks with like my gray couch and then some like cream pillows. Really like that. My coffee table, my new one is in my car, but it's too heavy to lift by myself. So I'm kind of waiting on that front to switch out like my coffee table, you know? Oops. And then I ended up changing my aligners for the first time. This is aligner number two. I changed it last night. Woohoo, making progress on that. But I still have like a little bit of a list, but it's fine. We will deal with it. So what should I start with first? I have it all laid out here on my bed. So let's go ahead and start with Skims. What I love is the fact that Nordstrom carries Skims because it's really nice that if things don't fit that I can just go in store and return things. You know what I mean? That always gives me peace of mind versus like spending money to return ship things back. I hate that so much. But I've been dying to try this line out. And when I saw that it was at Nordstrom, I was like, you know what, why not? So the first thing is this robe. It is like the cream color and it's just like this ultra plush, oh, so soft robe. It has, you know, a little tie detail and then it has two pockets on the side. Super cute. And then along with like the cream stuff, I ended up picking up the tang top. Same material, it's super soft. I actually ended up rolling the bottom of this in the try on because against like the pants and stuff, it was just like a little too long. I should mention some sizes around here. So this I got in a size extra, extra small, extra small, and this as well, extra, extra small, extra small. Actually all of this, that's the size, extra, extra small, extra small. Next thing up is the cream shorts. These are so cute. They're very high-waisted as a heads up and they are a little bit more on the longer side, but that's really nice for lounging around. I also picked up the cream in the pants. You'll see on, these are actually pretty long on me, so I would just take them to Nordstrom and see if they can hem them just a little bit for me, but otherwise they fit like a dream. They're really tight on, they're really high-waisted, and they're just super freaking comfortable and stretchy, you know? And then I also got this color. It's coming off a little pink. I forget what color it's called. I think it's called Dusk. I'm not sure, I'll make sure I'm putting that information down below for you guys. But I ended up getting the exact same thing. So I got the shorts here, I got the tank top in this color, and then I also got the pants as well. The color, it's funny when I got it, it comes off a little pink, but when I put it on my body, I feel like it looks like a really nice and neutral color. So a bit interesting, but really like that. And then I wasn't sure about this color, so I only got the pants to try out, but it's the camel color. You will see that this actually, there's a lot of lint <laughs> with this. I have like a bunch of like little things all over my bed. But yeah, anyways, I got this camel color in a size extra, extra small, extra small too in the pants and absolutely love all of that stuff. And then coming around to Lululemon, so these things just got released two days ago and I immediately picked them up. This looked very intriguing to me. It's the LA Boxy Sleeveless Hoodie. I got it in a size extra small, small. I thought this would look really nice with like joggers or something, maybe put like a long sleeve underneath it too. But I really like this color, it's called Dune. Following the same lines of the Dune color. I actually picked up these sweat shorts as well. It's from the same line, the LA brand, I guess. The LA French Terry High Waist Long Short. Got this in a size two, that's the smallest size that these comes in. And really like the waist is absolutely perfect on me. Like I don't think that the size zero in the waist would have fit, I think it would have been too tight. It does puff out a little bit on the sides but it's just like a really comfortable fit and then I got this matching like racer back but halter at the same time it's like a super halter in the front and it's something that I actually really like I really like this color again size 2 color dune don't mind me when I was trying this on I did not wear a bra with it so we'll just ignore that but make sure you know wearing a bra if that's your jam if you want to do that. And then I got the same racer back in the frontier color as well I love 
this color so much and it's gonna pair with so many things so these are really great staples to have this actually reminds me of the Ritzia tank top that I love so much from them it's like almost the same style and then I picked up the sweat shorts in frontier color as well size 2 you'll see in the try on on these in particular I rolled up the bottoms a little bit so that you could see what it looks like just like a little bit shorter I'm thinking I want to go into lululemon and see if they are able to like just shorten it like an inch or two I feel like for my frame it's a little bit overwhelming and it's a little too long but otherwise this is actually really really soft really nice material it's not like super lightweight but it's not heavyweight either it's kind of like right there in the middle so I really like the weight and the fabric of this that's all of the items it's actually really funny like looking at it it's like a lot of like the same tone can you tell what my favorite color is at the moment like still like some super neutrals you know it's currently a Thursday and this video is going up tomorrow so I'm gonna go and start to edit this video it is a few days so I need to gather all the footage together and start to put it together for you and get it up for you by tomorrow morning hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog so much activities and so many things going on the past couple of days so hopefully you guys enjoyed tagging along a little bit before you go please make sure you're subscribed and follow me on instagram and i will see you in a couple of days in my next video bye guys love you